I'm sorry about this, Shepard. We've got orders from Benezia. Open fire!
You do not know the privilege of being a mother. There is power in creation. To shape a life, turn it toward happiness or despair. Her children were to be ours, raised to hunt and slay Saren's enemies. I won't be moved by sympathy, no matter who you bring into this confrontation. Liara's here because she's a member of my crew. Indeed. What have you told him about me, Liara? What could I say, Mother? That you're insane? Evil? Should I explain how to kill you? What could I say? Have you faced an Asari commando unit before? Few humans have. I can't believe you'd kill your own daughter. I now realize I should have been strict. This is not over. Saren is unstoppable. My mind is filled with his light. Everything is clear. Start talking, Venezia. What's Saren's next move? I will not betray him. You will. You... You must listen. Saren still whispers in my mind. I can fight his compulsions briefly, but the indoctrination is strong. Why are you able to break free of his control now? I sealed a part of my mind away from the indoctrination, saving it for a moment when I could help destroy him. It will not last long. We met Shiava on Pharos. She told us about Sovereign's indoctrination. It is a terror to be trapped in your mind. To beat upon the glass as your hands torture and murder. I was powerless. Nothing but a tool for Saren. He sent me here to find the location of the Mew Relay. Its position was lost thousands of years ago. Tell me where the Mew Gate is before I lose my temper. Of course, Commander. I transcribed the data to an OSD. Take it, please. There isn't much time. I transmitted the coordinates to Saren before you arrived. You have to stop me. I, I can't. His teeth are at my ear. Fingers on my spine. You should, you should, oh, you should. Mother, I don't leave. Fight him. You've always made me proud, Liara. Die! I can 
cannot go on. You will have to stop him, Shepard. Hold on. We've got Nedigel. Maybe we can... No. He is still in my mind. I am not entirely myself. I never will be again. Mother. Good night, little wing. I will see you again with the dawn. No light. They always said there would be a... serves as our voice. We cannot sing. Not in these low spaces. Your musics are colorless. Musics? What? Your way of communicating is strange. Flat. It does not color the air. When we speak, one moves all. This is going to be a fun conversation. We are the mother. We sing for those left behind. The children you thought silenced. We are Rachni. Did you order your people to kill the science team? No. We were locked away here. The children are beyond our songs. They have been lost to silence. You are not in harmony with those who hoped to control us. What will you sing? Will you release us? Are we to fade away once more? Commander, I don't trust this thing. We know it's kind or killers. The tank is rigged with acid. I recommend using it. They made a mistake. They let the Krogan go too far. This is a chance for us to atone. She has done nothing to us. Your companions hear the truth. You have the power to free us, or return our people to the silence of memory. I won't destroy your entire race. You'll go free. There's a reason their kind were hunted to extinction. It's better to be safe than let a dangerous race loose. Their kind? Interesting choice of words, Chief. I don't want to trust the safety of my little sisters to this... alien. It's better to be sure. You will give us the chance to compose anew? We will remember. We will sing of your forgiveness to our children.
We need to hurry, Commander. My... Benezia said she transmitted the Mew Relay's coordinates to Saren. He may have already gone through. We can't follow him. That relay's inside the Terminus systems. They're not fond of Alliance ships over there, or Spectres. The Conduit's on Ilos. That's where Saren is heading. I plan to be waiting when he gets there. Saren probably has his whole fleet in orbit around Ilos. You will never make it down to the surface without reinforcements. You need to alert the Council. They will assemble a fleet to accompany you. It is our only hope. Crew dismissed. Joker, alert the Council. Tell them everything. Aye, aye, Commander. the mission update to the Citadel, Commander. We got confirmation on those reinforcements. Ambassador Udino wants us to report back to the Citadel. The Council's massing a joint species fleet to deal with Saren and his Geth. Took them long enough. Back to the Citadel, Joker. I want the Normandy at the head of that fleet. Yes, sir. Good job, Shepard. Thanks to you, the Council's finally taking real action against Saren. The Ambassador is correct. If Saren is foolish enough to attack the Citadel, as you believe, we will be ready for him. Patrols are stationed at every mass relay linking Citadel space to the Terminus systems. How many ships are you sending to attack Ilos? Ilos is only accessible to the Mew Relay, deep inside the Terminus systems, Commander. If we send a fleet in there, the only possible outcome is full-scale war. Now is the time for discretion, Commander. Saren's greatest weapon was secrecy. Exposed, he is no longer a threat. This is over. If Saren finds the conduit, we're all screwed. We have to go to Ilos. Ambassador Udina, I get the sense Commander Shepard isn't willing to let this go. There are serious political implications here, Shepard. Humanity's made great gains thanks to you, but now you're becoming more trouble than you're worth. You bastard! You're selling us out! It's just politics, Commander. You've done your job, now let me do mine. We've locked out all the Normandy's primary systems until further notice you're grounded. Nobody stabs me in the back, Udina. Nobody. I think it's time for you and your team to leave, Commander. This no longer concerns you. The Council can handle this, with my help, of course. I hate being right. I wish I could say I was surprised. I was surprised Udina bought into it. I guess he's like any other politician. The Council's used to being the biggest kid on the playground. They don't want to believe Daddy's coming to pick them up. And eat them, I guess. I don't care if I have to go to President Huerta. I won't sit back and wait for the Reapers to start killing people. Whatever you come up with, you can count me in. I know I'm not the easiest person in the world to get to know, so I'll do you a favor. Just this once. I... want you to be happy. Whatever you need, I'll help. There. You made me say it. Boom goes my feminine mystique. I've had a hell of a time figuring you out. But I think I have. I want you to be happy, too. You better.
Sorry to interrupt, Commander. Got a message from Captain Anderson. What did he want? Only said to meet him in that club in the wards. Flux. Sounds important. You'd better go. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. After years of poor economic performance, Exogeny has announced that its research colony on Pharos is finally returning a profit. New discoveries and a dedicated colonization effort have finally paid off for Exogeny. Exogeny stock rose sharply with the announcement, with investors pleased at this surprising news. Commander Shepard? Kalisa been seen in Aljalani, Westernland News. Would you answer a few questions for our viewers? What sort of questions? People back home have heard a lot of wild stories about you, Commander. I can give you the chance to set the record straight. What do you say? So long as you understand that I may not be able to answer all questions. I'm sure our viewers will understand. Humans have been trying to get the respect of the galactic community for 26 years. With that in mind, what are your feelings on being the first human Spectre? Appointment is the Citadel throwing humans a bone. Have you encountered any situations where the Citadel asked you to place its needs before the needs of Earth? I think they know not to ask me to work against my own people. I think our viewers will be glad to hear that, Commander. You've been given command of an advanced human warship for your missions. Is there anything you'd like to say about it? Many details are still classified, I'm afraid. I can tell you she's a fine ship and has the best crew I've ever served with. Some members of that crew are aliens, as I recall. Do you think it was appropriate to hand Earth's most advanced warship over to the Citadel? Miss Algelani, I wear the Alliance uniform. And if you think anyone other than me says where the Normandy can go, you're sadly mistaken. No offense intended, Commander. I'm sure you have to follow the orders of your superiors. Of course, now your superiors are aliens. Speaking of your new job, did the Council order you to sabotage human research concern on Novaria? The Council had nothing to do with it. There was an accident at Binary Helix Labs. In the interest of protecting the company's confidentiality, I can't say more. That's a surprising revelation, Commander. We've had nothing but stonewalling from Binary Helix. Given your recent experiences, do you think humanity will ever get the respect it deserves from the galactic community? Respect's a funny thing. People always assume they deserve it. The truth is, respect is earned. And I firmly believe we can earn it. You're an idealist, Commander, but a sincere one. I hope you're right. One last question, Commander. Rumors back home say you're tracking a rogue specter named Saren. Do you have any comment on that? Saren instigated the attack on our colony at Eden Prime. Once his involvement was proven to the Council, I was assigned to bring him in. That's... surprising, Commander. The official line says Eden Prime was attacked by rogue synthetics. Good luck in your mission. Thank you for your time, Commander Shepard.
see enough human in here. Soldier, I've got a major situation, and I need help from somebody with humanity's interests at heart. It's Commander, actually. What do you want? Of course, right to business. That's why humanity has the best. My name is Elias Keeler. I'm an alliance. You wouldn't believe what's riding on this. I'm fighting for Don't humanity. Don't try to sell me on this. Just tell me I what you want. I need you to want. buy a mental stimulant. It's legal, but restricted. I've purchased the monthly limit, and I need more. Getting you your drug fix is What high. century are you living in? Do you think those Solarians hesitate before? If you won't help me keep humanity strong, I'll find somebody else who will. Welcome to Flux. Name's Doran. What can I do for you? Is this a casino? Among other things, yes. We've got some Quasar stations, uh, if you're interested. Are you the owner? Owner, cook, and bartender. I've even been known to dance a little when the mood strikes me. We've got some Quasar stations, uh, if you're interested. Goodbye. Enjoy your time here at Flux. Sorry, I'm kind of busy right now. So, uh, what can I do for you? What were you discussing with the Volus? Who, Doran? Oh, uh, I was just at. Ugh, sorry. I don't want to bore you with my problems. I'm interested to hear what you have to say. Well, okay. My the problem is, she's working as an informant for CSEC. If they find out what she's doing, they'll kill her. Being an informant is That's a what I've been telling you. Well, I don't know. Sometimes I think she stays there just to spite me. Do you know who her contact is? No. Last time I asked an officer, he told me to stay out of it. For Jenna's safety. I hope it works out. All right. I'm glad you came, Shepard. I heard that. The Normandy's been grounded. I know, I'm sorry. I wanted to warn you, but there was no way to get a message to you before you docked. I know you're pissed off right now, but you can't give up. They all think this is over, but we both know it's not. You have to go to Ilos. You have to stop Saren from using the conduit. There's only one ship that can get me into the Terminus systems undetected, and she's grounded. Citadel controls locked out all the Normandy's systems, but if we override the Ambassador's orders, we can get them to bring the Normandy back online. You can be in the Terminus systems before anyone even knows you're gone. If we steal the Normandy, you're the one left holding the bag. And if Saren finds the conduit, life as we know it is over. The Reapers will destroy us. Humans, Asari, everybody. You're the only one who can stop him, Shepard. So I'll do whatever it takes to get you on the Normandy and off this station. I won't forget this, Captain. I promise. I can unlock the Normandy from one of the consoles in the Citadel Control Center. You'll have a few minutes before anyone realizes what happened. That's a restricted area patrolled by armed guards. How are you going to get in? Leave that to me. Just make sure you're in the Normandy when the systems come back online. There's got to be a better way. Ambassador Udina issued the lockdown order. If I can hack into the computer in his office, maybe I can override it. He's not going to let you waltz into his office and use his computer. Hopefully he won't be there. If he is, I'll just have to think of something. Udina won't let this slide, Captain. You'll be charged with treason, a capital offense. We don't have a lot of options. I break into the Ambassador's computer, or I take my chances with the patrols in Citadel Control. You'll have a better chance if you go after the Ambassador's computer. I was hoping you'd say that. The Ambassador has made this personal. You ready to get the hell off this station, Commander? Let's do it. I'll take care of the lockdown. You get down to the Normandy and tell Joker to stand by.
So, Garrus, any regrets about leaving CSAC? Fighting a rogue specter with countless lives at stake and no regulations to get in the way? I'd say that beat CSEC. True enough. I'd rather be fighting than trust it to somebody else. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. Anderson? What are you doing here? I didn't send... <clears throat> Get out of here, Joker. Now! Message coming in. Patching it through. Commander, Ms. Algelani's story on you just aired. She shouldn't have ambushed you like that. But you handled it the right way. I've never had to deal with you. You shouldn't friend. have to. This won't happen again, Commander. We have a press corps so personnel don't have to deal with her kind of BS. There is one other matter, however. The Citadel has been trying to play down Saren going rogue. It makes the Spectres look bad. Your mention of him was politically inconvenient. I wasn't aware of that. I won't discuss him again, sir. I'd appreciate that, Commander. I won't keep you any longer. Fifth Fleet out. Skipper? Don't you think we're a little past titles? We had to do this, Shepard. You know that. There was no other way. And you'll always be the Skipper to me. Oh, Captain, my Captain. First Alfred Tennyson, now Walt Whitman. You're full of surprises. Dad loved all those sappy poets. Mom was more into Plath. I'm not a word person, Shepard. Other people say what I mean better than I do. We're mutineers, sailing a stolen warship into the most hostile system in the galaxy. Just call us humanity's best and brightest. We wouldn't have been assigned to this ship if we weren't. We'll get it done. And if we don't, at least we won't have to face the firing squad. Death closes all. But something ere the end, some work of noble note, may yet be done not unbecoming men that strove with gods. We'll get home again, Shepard. I believe you'll lead us through. Oh, Captain? My Captain. It occurs to me that this might be our last night alive. Got any plans? Trying a frontal assault. Hmm. All that training, you'd think they'd teach you the best approaches indirect. To draw the enemy out of their fixed defenses. There are regs against this, you know. You ready to deal with the consequences? I've spent my whole life fighting to get what I want. To get it done, I had to bury a lot of things. During that whole time, not even once did I feel like I was worth what I was fighting for. 
You make me feel good enough. Bunk here tonight, Ash. With me. Bold word, Shepard. I like bold. Get up and get over here. Make me. That's a whole new spin for on the floor and give me 20, huh? <laughs> you still sassing me, soldier? I think you need more physical training. Tisk. Now, what will it take to prove I'm in prime condition, Skipper? Bridge to Commander Shepard. We're five minutes out from the Mew Relay. Well, duty calls. Get up to the bridge, Skipper. I've got other weapons to check out. Hey, Shepard. Whatever happens down there, I just wanted to say... Wait, you know what? I'm not telling you. You want to hear this? You'll just have to come back to me. Commander, we've got company. Have the sensors picked us up yet? Well, stealth systems are engaged. Unless we get close enough for a visual, they won't have any idea we're here. Picking up some strange readings from the planet's surface. Take us down, Joker. Lock in on the coordinates. Negative on that, Commander. The nearest landing zone's two clicks away. We'll never make it in time on foot. Get us something closer. There is nowhere closer. I've looked. Drop us in the Mako. You need at least a hundred meters of open terrain to pull off a drop like that. The most I can find near Saren is twenty. Twenty meters? No way we can make a drop in there. We have to try. Find another landing zone! There is no other landing zone! The descent angle's too steep. It's our only option. It's not an option. It's a suicide run. We don't... I can do it. Joker? I can do it. Gear up and head down to the Mako. Joker! Drop us right on top of that bastard. <laughs> 